If you're looking for legit stacked accounts on MB2K19, go hit up at legit accounts. Tell them Dance Teacher and they'll hook you right up. Link in the description, guys. But it looks, guys, we can confirm that there's going to be stages from 2K16, 2K17, or high rollers. There's going to be more than one park or one neighborhood, I mean. There's definitely not going to be no park affiliation because Ronnie2k said in live stream that they're not, they can't really figure it out how to do it in the game, I guess, or some shit like that. Some dumb shit he was saying. Holy shit, y'all. There's so much news that came out for 2K20. I didn't want to do my intro anymore, guys, because of how much news came out. So again, officially the uh, cover athlete for 2K20 is Anthony Davis. So finally, we got that. And we got Dwayne Wade as a Legend Edition. I might cop that one for sure. But write in the comments, guys, right now. Comment down below if you guys want to do a giveaway for 2K20. I'll definitely do the 2K20 if I get a lot of comments saying yes, no, no, you know, don't do it, Dan. It's all good. I can afford it. If you guys don't want me to do a giveaway, it's fine. But if you guys do want me to do a giveaway, comment down below yes or say something like that. Do you guys want me to do a, a giveaway for 2K20? I'll definitely do one. Now, the news I want to stick on to, guys, is definitely the parks and neighborhoods like that. So, for sure, in 2K20, we're definitely going to get neighborhood again. We're not going to get parks. We're not going to get affiliations. Now, this is just like speculation by me. All right, I'm not going to say there is or not. Now, this is no clickbait or something like that. I don't really know Ronnie or something like that. But again, by the looks of it, it's mostly going to be, um, you know, neighborhood again. But there could be more than one neighborhood. So again, the reason why I think Ronnie said that, you know, they're not going to bring back um, park affiliations is because of this. I'm going to show you guys a clip of what the hell he's talking about right now. ...of the neighborhood. Now, look, it's cool to, like, be part of, like, little groups, little mini communities. But that's sort of what pro -Am is for now. Um to do it like to split three ma one massive group into three massive groups is it just creates problems you don't get to play with people as much like it's it's not good so if we could figure out a way to kind of like thread that needle then uh we would but we'll see if we can figure that out so some of you don't understand what the hell was talking about when you're saying that, you know, they're going to have problems when they're planning. With you. Now, I don't understand why you bring up that reason that, you know, saying that people are not going to play with each other. Sometimes it's going to create a problem. OK, that doesn't make any sense because, you know, 2K16, 2K17, that wasn't really an issue with, the, you know, playing with people. Now, the problem is that, remember, listen, guys, back in, you know, 2K15, 2K16, 2K17 days, they didn't have um they didn't have dedicated servers. All right. They didn't have all this shit. So what dedicated servers is that, you know, you connect to a server from, I guess, in a certain state and you, and you play from there. So back in 2K16, 2K17, it was like Mono for 2 days. So if you guys do remember Mono for 2 or, you know, some like games like older, like COD 4 or, or BO2, right? Or let's say if the host leaves, it says migrating host and it changes the host. It's basically, it's basically the same exact thing as like that. So in 2K16, 2K17, there was a host in a game and if he left... It would say like, you know, migrate to a different host in the game in 2K16, 2K17. You just wouldn't see the, you know, the screen saying migrate to a different host. It would just an auto you just put a different host. So again, listen guys, the problem with this, I guess with the park, I'm assuming he's like trying to say is that he's putting, I guess, one whole massive group in that one neighborhood to three. It's gonna create ex extreme problems with the servers and they really can't handle it. So I'm assuming that's what he's trying to say. It just the little, I guess the reason why he said with the people and shit like that was a stupid thing. I don't know why he did that. I don't know why he even said that shit. But I'm assuming the problem was that the server issues and shit like that. So again, if you guys are tired with the servers and shit like that and you guys wanna make it way worse, I'm assuming you guys could if you guys bring out the park fleet. So they don't wanna do that yet. They just wanna fix, I guess, this and then work on, I guess, making more servers so they can handle more people. I'm assuming they're not going to bring back park affiliation. Now, it could change. I'm not for sure. Remember, he just said they haven't figured it out yet. Now, they could figure it out maybe like in a couple months. So it just depends. Maybe. I don't know. But they could just add into the game real quick. It's not going to be that much of a change. You're just going to add some logos. Add park affiliation. That's it. You're basically done. So, they could do that. They could not. It just depends on, like I guess... Well, if they want to work on it again now let's just talk about the more of the parks now there could be multiple parks so don't rule this theory out now it could be all right we don't know yet but the way it looks by the covers and shit like that d wade has more like a sunset type of ball parkish i guess type of field like a sunset beach and then you know uh, uh, anthony davis's cover is more like an old town rivet combination basically with the little i guess the train in the background so it's more of like a rivet and uh and old town type of feel to it so again 
there might be two parks now instead of one neighborhood now that could be better a little bit but they got to fix that issue where you know people just stand around in this park right here and you get burning the game so again make it more like i guess 2k 18 ish but still have the feeling of a 2k 16 2k 17 type of feel to it to the park so again keep that in mind uh whoever is a dev watching this or maybe they're gonna make for 2k 21 not for sure because i think they already had the game already planned out for 2k 20 so basically all the things that we're just saying right now is just speculation so again guys what i hope or i guess by the theory what i'm going for guys i definitely they're gonna have two parks they're not gonna have a park affiliation now they're gonna bring back maybe the stage or the high rollers if you guys don't know what the hell that is in 2k16 2k17 they had a little train background to it it was like a little high rise or not high rise but it was like a top of like uh uh what is this called a penthouse and they had this like um what is this called like a train station that goes around in 2k16 2k17 stage and they had the same stage for like a while but again that stage had a little train so i'm assuming they're gonna bring that stage back i hope they do to be honest because i like that stage a lot i've gotten used to it so much in 2k16 2k17 now in 2k15 i didn't play the stage that much so i can't really say anything i, was per I first started playing 2k14 skipped 2k15 and then i started playing um 2k16 2k17 2k18 and so on so by the looks guys we can confirm that there's gonna be stays from 2k16 2k17 or high rollers there's gonna be more than one park or one neighborhood i mean there's definitely not gonna be no park affiliation because ronnie2k said in live stream that they're not they can't really figure it out how to do it in the game i guess or some shit like that some dumb shit he was saying so again hope you that the video i'll come out with any news or anything that comes out with the archetypes no matter what the my team play now whatever it is i will tell you guys any information but i'm out y'all peace